What you see right here is Iron Man with working achievements, Immortal Skanderberg and First Day World Conquest with negative development. In this video, I will show you the most broken exploit possible. To use our wonderful exploit and make any of this nation's OP, we need to modify some game files. If you bought the game in Steam, the files are right here. Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, Europe Universalis. Anyway, now that you found your game folder, you need to find the folder called History. It's right here, History. And there are two important folders right here. One is Countries, one is Provinces. So, what I really, really recommend to do, to not mess up your Iron Man. If you don't do it, you might need to uninstall and download E4 once again. So it's really important to first make a backup. So you should do this. For example, right click on Countries, copy, paste in separate folder. Same with Provinces. Remember, it's really, really important. By doing this, you will be able to restore the previous state of E4. Now that's where we can break the game. That's where the fun is. So let's, for example, open Countries. So what we see right here is a list of tags. I want Rukyu. Okay, I want to get three mountains. Like this, Rukyu. And it's all information about Rukyu. Its religion, its tag group, its garment, and all of their historical rulers. Let's go back to our game and find Rukyu. So it has skin Shitatsu Sho. Now let's go to our text file, find the skin, find him, here it is. And let's make him OP. Death date. Basically this means the ruler will die on this date. Let's modify it to 1821. Let's make him 666. Yes, it's really simple, just like this. We can even make our ruler a general, just like this. This lines make our ruler a general with 999 fire, shock, maneuver, and siege. And we can even change our ruler personality. To not mess this up, I recommend to just open any other nation txt file with set personalities, like England, for example, and let's paste it. You can find personalities right in this file. Script the triggers. For example, I want to make a ruler immortal. Here it is, immortal personality. Let's copy it and let's paste it. Okay, we changed the history files. And now let's see how this works. Just demonstration. So as you might see, something is weird. Ryukyu has 666 ruler. Huh. And you can earn achievements. Looks legit. Let's take a look. Huh, interesting. Achievements do work. And wow, we've got 666 ruler. Let's take a look. Oh, it has 999 stats. Oh, wow. So as you can see, our exploit was successful. We can earn achievements and we have insane ruler. Now you might ask, why isn't he immortal? The answer is, I don't know. He should be, but he is not. Okay, now let me show you how to do it. And let's alter a few more things. First, I'm going to create a separate text document somewhere. I don't know where, just separate one. Now let's go and restore how it was, the original state. That's why we made a backup after all. So here it is, here is my backup, and here is my live E4. Let's just paste, replace. Okay, so now I think let's change something maybe. Let's change something a little bit more. Let's make Riku effort. Let's give it Western group. Oh, and maybe let's make it Hindu. I love Hindu. Now let's launch E4. Okay, now here's the trick. Follow me really carefully. You create an Iron Man safe as any nation, literally anyone, doesn't matter. Just make sure it's not the nation you want to play. For example, here I created the save of min. Okay, you click right here to load the save. Do not click anything else, just don't. Believe me, you don't want to. What you want to is to access your favorite text document. Ctrl C. Now open the text document in live u4 folder. Here it is in Steam Apps Commons. Ctrl A, Ctrl V, save. Now very important. Once again, do not click anything else. Do not. Just go historical start. Here it is, 666 ruler, looking good. Iron Man, achievements can be earned this session. Be really careful, do exactly as I've shown. Do not click anything else because this is the only way it will work, believe me. I've tried. Let's start it up. Okay, the tribe of Ryukyu, that's already funny. Let's take a look. Okay, so it seems I accidentally broke the game. I'm no religion, I'm at least Ryukyu. Ideally, you need to go and consult the wiki about all of this. It has a list of all modifiers. But I didn't. Anyway, uh, we are tribe. That's good. Yes, we are step nomads. We have awesome ruler. 666. Once again, not immortal. I don't know why. I think I've made some mistake in 18 hour history. But anyway, yeah, it works. 999 stats. Just perfect. And we can earn achievements. That's not the most broken thing. 
I will make it even better. Okay, let's have a little bit more fun. So, find the provinces. Here they are, European Universalis, History Provinces. In this case, our province to want is Okinawa. Here it is. Well, this one is a little bit easier to understand. So, here we go. We can change the religion, we can change anything. For example, let's change to Hinduism. By the way, it's not Hindu. Trade goods. Both. Just take a look what we can do. We can add to HRE. We can add a lot of tax, a lot of production, a lot of manpower. Okay, let's do the same trick. Let's load our dummy save game. One, two, three. Once again, do not touch anything, do not click anything, do not, don't. Yeah. Now let's just copy our results into the game. Here we go, one. And history countries. Let's replace it with our modified RQ. Now let's go back to the game. Historical start, do not click anything, once again. I tried and it showed that I can't earn achievements, so be careful. RQ. Okay, that's already interesting, don't you think? No. <laughs> Achievements can be earned. Okay, that's good. That's good. Always happy. Always happy to earn achievements with Hindu RQ with minus million development. It's always good. Let's take a look. Okay, huh. That's weird. That's weird. Hindu hard. Okay, where are we? Where, where is RQ? I can't find it. I can't see it. Oh, yeah, here it is. Okay, it's bad. It's, it's bad. It's bad. It's really bad. I broke the game. Oh my god, I broke the game. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. So we have gloves. We literally broke the game with our development. We are Hindu. We are Hort with Immortal 666 Ruler and Legendary Pirate and Legendary Conqueror. Okay, if you think that's broken, no, it's not. It's not. It's not yet. Oh my god. Oh, you see? I earned achievement. Rax and Riches. Yes, you can earn achievements. I know, it's broken. Oh my god. I think we see only Western countries because we are in Western culture group. I'll change it back. Wait, just so you don't struggle. My mistake was that I put Ruler Personalities, this stuff, inside Monarch brackets. Put it outside, somewhere here. Before last bracket, but after this one. And once again, don't forget to restore the original files. Backup is really important. Okay, if you thought that was OP. Yes, I agree, it was OP. Now I'll show you the new level of OP. So, I use Visual Studio Code for this. You can do it manually, I just prefer to do it in smart way, so to say. File, open folder, open folder with your provinces. So here it is, I open pro folder with our provinces, provinces, on the list of them, right? Control shift h once again control shift h shortcut now just copy what i've done here it's regular expression it finds all of this owner stuff and replace don't forget to click this use regular expression and let's replace it like this okay first let's put up the game obviously it won't work once again let's do the same nothing to reinvent now don't click anything return to our visual studio code here i will replace with this owner RYU, RQ, this is tag for RQ, okay. Well, it works with any nations. Like, for example, if I type here owner equals ink, it will make England owner, but I want RQ. Still click for this time. Let's click enter. Let's click replace all, control, alt, enter. Replace all occurrences and... Okay, it's taking its time. Okay, it's done. Now, let's do the same, but replace here with controller. Controller equals RQ. And one last thing, and... Core. I'll replace with at core rook. Control Alt Enter. Place all. I think we are done with Visual Studio Code. Let's go back. Click historical start. Do not click anything else. For the love of God. Okay, I think I officially broke the game because it didn't want to load. Okay. And just take a look. So it didn't really work out as I planned. I don't know why. Doesn't matter. It's still easy worth focus. Achievements can be earned. Let's go. Let's check it out. Oh my God! It's beautiful. It's beautiful. And we can earn achievements. We can. Let's take a look at our provinces, because it's weird. So, we do have cores. Okay. We do have cores. For some reason, it didn't work out as I planned, but we do have cores on whole world, right? Yeah, on almost whole world. Yeah, it's, it, it, it's insane. Just insane. And I think let's wrap it up just one last time. I will show you that it works with any nation. So, save game start. Choose our previous save. Just click it. That's it. I will give Albanian capital inside development. Make it Sunni. Now let's make Albania Sunni. Make Skanderberg even better. I will add some traits to our favorite Skanderberg. Make him have insane stats. Let's make Albania own the world. Let's replace everything. And yes, by the way, I changed our regular expression a little. I'm not sure if it works better or not, but I think it does. I think it gets more results. Owner, controller, add core. And let's change religion. I will change religion to Sunni. Now let's click historical start. Once again, don't click anything else, just historical start. Oh my god, 
the game is almost crashed. And here we go. Glorious Albania. And achievements can be earned. Once again, I don't know why we didn't conquer everything. I guess it's a small pack. But anyway, we do have course on all provinces. We should Let's check out religion. Yeah, as you can see, I think it's just a pack with Visual Studio Code. It then change all provinces TXT file. But anyway, here we go. Albania with Immortal Skanderberg. And our capital should be... Okay, my mistake, it's not our capital. But anyway, it's our province. It is, as you can see, quite developed. Yes, as you can see, the only reason why we haven't done World Conquest yet is that Visual Studio Code didn't replace all of the stuff. Let's try it again. Yeah, as you can see, it found new results. I don't know why. Maybe it's just too much files to handle. Anyway, if someone has a better way to do this, you can suggest in comments. But yeah, this will work for World Conquest. Maybe we'll need to change it manually. Thank you for watching with this video. Hope you liked it. If you liked it, please like it and subscribe to my channel. Have a good day.